Um, hi, um, I'm John Struber uh, from Australia. Um, Art in Action has kindly invited me to become part of the demonstrators tent here for the last three years. I fly my work out from Australia. I do a couple of workshops while I'm out here and a couple of other shows now. And uh, my specialty is um, crystalline glazes. My passion is the curve and the bottle, which is obvious by the amount of bottles around. Uh, for the last, I've been potting for almost 40 years and uh, I still have my first ovoid form that I made in 74 that I've kept as a reminder that that's what I'm going to do when I grow up as a potter and now I'm following my passion. I saw my first potter in Amsterdam when I was five. That thing happened where you said that's what you're going to do when you grow up but I never went through life wanting to be a potter. I didn't know what I was going to do. Um, but I had an arty bent and I started off as sculpture, didn't have enough facilities and the ceramics teacher said, why don't you try clay? As Soon as I touched it, that was it, I'd found my thing. And I've just had a passion for it ever since. The two things I love doing is teaching um, and demonstrating, primarily because I know how I, the effect that first time that I saw a potter had on me. The feedback I get, there's, there's feedback on what I do as a potter. People love to see the shapes I make, that I'm very delicate and, and controlled compared to just forcing the clay into submission. They can see there's another way of doing it. And also here, having my pots on display, I'm away from my studio. Um, so I can see the pots on display and evaluate them, but also I get feedback from the public. With Art in Action, well, I'll give you an example. I had a uh, friend who I hadn't seen for 40 years came back into my life last year. He was very stressed. He was a graphic designer. Uh, and he said he wanted to paint full time. And he was going on a tour through Europe. I said, come to Art in Action. He was so inspired by seeing all these artists working uh, that he went home and quit his job. And he, I saw he, he works now near me. I actually gave him some studio space for a little while to get himself established. And he said to me just before I left to come over here, he has never been so happy and it's the best thing he ever, he ever did. So there's one person this shows has changed his life.